All right, the last technique that we use as a jet defender, okay, again, this is primarily for defensive ends. It can also be for defensive tackles, um, but primarily for ends. The last technique is a race technique, what we call a race technique. I am a race player, okay, when I am a jet defender and the running back is away from me. The running back is away from me. So again, I'm a jet defender and the running back's away from me. So in this case, the running back is away from me and I'm a jet player. Okay, we're pretending like there's a guy here. Okay. I'm gonna get vertical up the field and I wanna get to the I wanna get to the heels of the quarterback. Okay, so no longer am I gonna get one yard from the LOS from the line of scrimmage. I'm gonna get to the heels line of the quarterback. I want to get up the field right now. Okay? The reason this is twofold. One, we want to stop all the power read and, and, and uh, what pe some people call dash game. Some people call it dash. Some people call it power read. Some people call it inverted veer. Where the running back's crossing the quarterback's face, okay? And he's going to be a sweet guy, and the quarterback's going to be the dive style player. Okay, whether he's running power or inside zone or trap or any of that type of stuff. Okay, the only way we can do that is if we get vertical up the field. If you stop when you're off the line of scrimmage, you're never going to get there. So you got to get up to the heels of the quarterback. Once the quarterback declares that he's pulling the football, so once he pulls the ball, I can then fold back inside to make the play. Then I can fold back inside. So I actually become what we call a two for one player because I take away the jet sweep. And I fold back inside to take the quarterback. Okay? I take away the jet sweep, and then I fold back inside to take the quarterback. The same thing, you can use the same technique if you had a receiver and you knew they were running a lot of jet sweep. You could tell the defensive end, hey, if I am a jet player to the field, I'm going to be in a race technique. So that now does the same thing for, say, a fly sweep style play. Okay? It also helps with the reach block. It also helps with the reach block because if I'm in a race technique, if I'm in a race technique, okay, and they're running outside zone or stretch and they're trying to reach me and I'm getting up the field right now, I got a lot better of a chance, okay, to make sure I don't get reached than if, for example, I was playing a regular jet defender and I was only getting to one yard past the tackle or one yard to the up, uh, past the LOS line of scrimmage. Okay, so now we're trying to get vertical as much as possible to stop outside zone, to stop uh, jet sweep, to stop power read and inverted rear. So that is a race technique, which if I'm a jet defender and the running back is away from me, okay, I can use.